All right, hey guys, it's Destiny here. If you're wondering why I'm doing a voiceover and what I'm actually saying on the video is different, it's because uh, my Nikon camera, the autofocus would not stop um, focusing, of course, because it's on autofocus. So that's all you hear really throughout the video, and I know it would probably be annoying to some of you guys. So I just thought, well, let me go ahead and just do a voiceover. So today I'll be showing you guys my favorite hair products that work for me. Just a disclaimer, what works for me might not work for you, but that's okay because a lot of the products that I use do have sample products. So go ahead and go to your Walmart, Target, Sally, pick it up, try it out. I do have 4C type hair, so I, a lot of the products that I use are uh, very thick consistency um, because my hair needs that. But I do hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I do hope you start this journey along with me on YouTube, and let's get right into it. The first product I'll be showing you guys is my shampoo. It is called Kinky Curly Come Clean Moisturizer Shampoo. I've been using this shampoo for years now, and what I like to do, I like to add peppermint and tea tree oil in it. I like to shake it up, and when I lather my scalp down, I like to massage it with my hair massager. And then my scalp is tingly, and it feels really good and refreshed. And this is like my favorite, favorite shampoo right here. Like, it works amazing. Next is going to be my conditioner, and I like to use Aussie Miracle Moist, uh, the avocado and jojoba oil one. Um, this is my favorite one. I used to use the 3 Minute Miracle, but I've learned that this one right here actually works better for my hair. It's more moisturizing, and I get a better slip. I like to use this for a co-wash, um, a conditioner, if I need to detangle my hair before I shampoo. So this is the uh, conditioner that I use. The next thing I'm going to show you guys is my favorite, favorite deep conditioner. I've been using it for years, and it's called Blueberry Bliss Reparative Hair Mask by Curls. And it smells really, really, really good. There's no sulfates, no silicone, no parabens, any of that. It smells actually like blueberries, to me at least. And it's a deep penetrating intensive conditioning hair mask for natural hair, of course. Um, I'm pretty sure relaxed girls can use it. It's a very thick consistency. Um, my hair loves thick products. If it's not a thick product, it really won't work. Work, it'll be like, you know, too, I guess too watery and it won't, I won't have that slip that I like. But this gives me the slip and I love it. For the next deep conditioner that I love, unfortunately, I don't have the container anymore because I ran out, but it's by Eden Coconut Shea Reparative Hair Mask, and also it is very thick. It's my second favorite. Um, I've been using it for a few months now, almost three months. I always get it from Marshalls where I'm at in North Carolina. I have yet to find it in a store. I only went to Walmart to look, but it works really well. Also has a thick consistency. So moving on to moisturizers, the first one I'm going to show you guys is by Eden. It's the Coconut Shea Natural Curl Defining Cream. It's a humidity resistant formulation designed to refine and separate curls and waves. This right here is amazing. It has no mineral oils, no dyes, no parabens, and it's cruelty free. I like to use this on a quick wash and go or a twist out. It works really well on my 4A. All my four hair type girls, or even three, you should definitely try this product out because it does not, and I mean does not, disappoint. The next moisturizer I'm going to show you guys is by My L. It's the Pomegranate and Honey Twisting Souffle. It enhances curls with semi-deep definition with intense hydration for thick, curly, type 4 hair. So this is specifically made for type 4 hair. Now, I'm not saying type 3 hair cannot use it. I think you guys should give it a try. But I will say this is a very thick product. And I do know like a lot of 4 type hair loves very thick products. As you can see, it's very thick. It's one of my favorites. It's not the favorite, but it is one of my top three. And I do recommend this product. They, they do have um, little packets in Walmart, if I'm not mistaken. So if you guys don't want to invest in the whole jar right away, just try the packets out. And I'm pretty sure you guys would love them. Okay, so the next two moisturizers I'll be showing you guys is by Curls. One is the Blueberry Coconut Hair Milk. And the other one is the Cream Beulet Whip Curl Cream. I've been using the whipped curl cream longer than I've been using the blueberry coconut hair milk, but both work really well. I think my favorite would have to be the whipped curl cream though, only because I feel like I get more slip. But like I said, the blueberry coconut hair milk works just as good. Both are top notch brand, top notch products. I definitely recommend 10 out of 10. So ladies out there, definitely try that. 
The next product I'll be showing you guys is the Coconut Co-Wash by As I Am. It has tangerine, coconut oil, castor oil, and saw palmetto oil in it. I've been using this co-wash for almost two and a half years now. I actually put my sister on to this co-wash in this actual brand, and she loves them, as so do I. I swear by this product. What I like to do, I like to get in the shower, drench my hair, work it in, and then rinse it out and go ahead and do my hair care routine. But this product right here is not as thick as I would like it. But at the same time, it's just a quick cleanse for my scalp. It's not like a deep moisture, deep conditioner or anything like that. So I'll take it. But I will say this is a good recommendation for ladies. If you need something quick and you don't want to shampoo your hair, just go ahead and use the coconut co-wash and you will not be disappointed. The next thing I'll be showing you guys is the Super Detangle Spray that I use by Curly Kids. It is a mixed texture hair care line, but I have 4A hair and it works perfectly fine for me. It is very moisturizing. I love using this on a hot summer day when my hair just needs a little moisture. I also like to use it after I shampoo and condition my hair. If I have little kinks still in it, I like to spray it and rake my fingers through my hair really quick and my knots and tangles are gone. This product right here has changed my hair for the better. This is the Afro-G Keratin Green Tea Reconstructor Spray. I use this after every single wash. You guys, this product right here is amazing. The whole Afro-G line is great, but this is my favorite from the entire line. I have um, chemical treated hair. My hair is dyed black, and before I dyed my hair black, I had blonde highlights in it, and my hair used to break off very, very bad. But after I use this product, my hair does not break off anymore. It's much stronger, and it definitely does the job. These are the oils I use. I use avocado oil, which is the big bottle right there. And then I also use extra virgin olive oil, which is that little bottle. I also like to use black Jamaican castor oil, sweet almond oil, jojoba oil, and my favorite, honestly, probably be red pimento oil. That grew my hair so much in a stage where my hair just stopped growing. So I definitely stand by that product, ladies. Definitely give it a try. It's at your local beauty supply store. You might find it at Target or Sally's. I don't know. I always get it from my beauty supply store. But those are the oils I use. And I, for some reason, this is the only edge control that I can use. And it's not even really edge control. It's just like gel. But I've tried many edge controls and they just don't work. This one right here is the only thing that works to my edges. I, as you can tell, my edges are not done in the video. Do not judge. <laughs> but like I said, this is the only one that works for me. If I want to slay my edges for a night or just for work or something, I use that one. I use the punk. I actually just found out that they have different names for them. But like I said, it works. All right, so that's the end of the video. I do hope you all enjoyed. I hope you learned a lot. and I hope it was very informative for some of you. Um, like I said, this is new to me. I did YouTube two years ago. I posted like three videos and I stopped for reasons, but I'm picking it back up now. I'm back and better than ever. Um, just bear with me, you know, as I'm fixing my camera issues. This is why I'm doing voiceovers. I hope you guys can understand and it's very clear for you. But I do want to just say thank you for watching. Like, comment, and subscribe. My next video will be me showing you guys my wash day routine and the process of me washing my hair and detangling and conditioning and all of that. But like I said, I hope you guys enjoyed and I'll see you guys later.